Barbara and Mojica, a.k.a. Little Miss History, back with you again for another session of the Two Minute Teacher. How to set up a mini lesson in a couple of minutes. Today's topic is finding opposites. Now your child can enrich vocabulary by learning the meanings of words and then extend that knowledge by finding the opposite of that word. In order to do that, I've listed a link to a fun crossword puzzle that you can download from my Pinterest board. Here is the puzzle. Now, your child will begin by looking at the words under the across column. And you might want to have a dictionary on hand or access to the internet in case there is a word that your child is totally unfamiliar with. And your child will learn that there is sometimes more than one answer. For instance, if you begin with across, the first word is above. So your child will need to understand, well, what does above mean? Well, it means on top of. So then what would be the opposite? Your child might first think of under. The correct answer is below, B-E-L-O-W. And you'll see that that is the correct number of boxes. Now, when you finish all of these words, your child will get what he or she thinks is the correct answer and then move to the down questions. Now, one down, says wrong. What's the opposite of wrong? Your child might first think of right, R-I-G-H-T. But when your child looks at the boxes that intersect with right, well, the second letter isn't an I. It's an O. Oh, what word could mean your right that has an O in it? The word is correct. So your child will be learning that there are alternatives and several possible meanings to a word. And you will, in this way, be greatly expanding vocabulary. So I hope that you will have fun with this activity. And you can keep the page, again, for reference in a notebook if your child needs to come back to it for referral. I hope that you will check out my other Two Minute Teacher lessons. You can find a listing of videos in the Two Minute Teacher section on my YouTube channel. And if you have a minute, check out all of my learning opportunities at www.littlemisshistory.com. I hope to see you next week. Bye for now.